guys, it's Saturday at the Toyota dealership and I'm trying to be discreet, but I'm stuck here for like two to four hours. That's the ballpark. And I thought nothing better to do but to make you guys a video. So keeping myself entertained and I thought I'd let you know what's going on with me. So some of you know that last night I went to urgent care because the burn that I had from a couple videos ago when my happy, happy, happy video, um, got infected. So right now, um, because I'm out and about in a public dirty place, I have it covered. Um, but when I don't have it covered, I have bacitracin on it. Unfortunately, he would not give me Silvadine. I tried to get him to prescribe it for me and he said, no way. So I'm taking an oral antibiotic for it and hopefully everything will heal up. I'm a little bit nervous about it. And infections on the hand are touchy and I have to worry about maceration of the skin and all that stuff so just trying to keep it clean and not angry and it's really making me cranky. <laughs> I'm here for a Toyota recall so I'm kind of stuck and it's important one otherwise I would have probably put it off for a few more weeks but to keep myself occupied I brought my copy of Divergent. I have been stuck on chapter five for months because it just hasn't been grabbing me the way I expected it to. It's a really simple read. I wouldn't call it a page turner, but I definitely want to read it before I see the movie. So I also brought with me my book and my workbook because I thought I've got a lot of time to kill, so maybe I should start diving into some of this stuff. I also brought snacks. I have two bags of these to keep me occupied depending on how long I'm here. And although this isn't technically water, it is a, a liter and a half of purified water with a little bit of sugar-free Arnold Palmer Arizona iced tea. Thank you, Jason, for this. Uh, I found it and it's not something I would typically drink, but I thought it would be something different than just straight water. Sometimes it gets a little bit boring, but once I'm done with that, just refill it with water the rest of the day. I wasn't allowed to go to boot camp this morning and I missed it desperately. The other thing I wanted to show you, I'm starting to get birthday presents coming in from my absolute besties. And this is from my dear friend, Laurel. She and I went to college together. We've been friends forever, ever since we met in the basement of one of the dorms when we were doing laundry and making popcorn and burning it. <laughs> But this is a laurel leaf dipped in silver, and it's got my birthstone on there, which also is her birthstone. She's a May baby as well. And this is incredibly sentimental to me because it's a laurel leaf, and it's from laurel. And when I was in India, I learned that they don't use bay leaves in their cooking when they need bay, they use laurel leaves in their cooking. So this has so much meaning to me and I can't even believe the thought that went behind this and Laurel, I love it. It's absolutely perfect. I will treasure it forever. Thank you so much. You're so thoughtful. Go drink some water or tea or whatever it is that you're drinking. Thanks for watching. See you soon.